What's going on my dudes? One Step here with the top five best fatal blows in Mortal Kombat 1. Take it one step at a time. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and let's get into these fatal blows. Now, what makes them the best is, I mean, honestly, all fatal blows are the same. They do the same damage, but these fatal blows are, first of all, very well done design wise and they break bones and blah, 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 but man, they make you go, whoa. Now, also, let me say this video is definitely going to get demonetized because I'm going to show you guys the full on fatal blow with no censorship. So if you could do me a solid favor and give this video a thumbs up, it would help support your boy here a lot. And let's get into these fatal blows. If you can't tell by her character design alone, Sindel is a ball buster and man her fatal blow shows it <laughs> oh my dude i it's just so hard to even watch that dude every time i do i'm like Oh my gosh. Very well done. 10 out of 10 fatal blow for sure. As the God of Fire, the protector of Earthrealm, you best believe that Liu Kang has a freaking badass fatal blow, man. It is one of the coolest things. There's two reasons why it's so cool. That dragon growl, the whole dragon, the Mortal Kombat icon appearing, coming down as basically a hyper beam from Pokemon into the ground. Not only that, but then it leaves the Mortal Kombat Signia on the ground. You see here beneath Scorpion, the Mortal Kombat Signia is burnt into the ground. And that is such a cool aesthetic that they added into the game. And I love it. Mwah, beautiful. As a Raiden main since MK9, I swear this is not biased, but man, the way they did Raiden's Fatal Blow in Mortal Kombat that one is gorgeous. The fact that he takes your opponent into the air, creates electric clones of himself, and then flies into you, sends you back to Earth, and then just curb stomps you? Yeah, yeah, that, that's top five for sure. Reigns, believe it or not, though it's really quick, it seems, is really cool. I just love the water bender aesthetic and then the electricity. You get it. Geysers of you into the air, water bends you, whips you, electrifies you, throws you back, dude. That is so good. Man, Gears has probably got to have one of the best fatal blows. I mean, honestly, just the aesthetic as the character, you know, the, the time master, keeper of time for infinite eons, and they really put that into his fatal blow, and it's just stunning. Any kind of fatal blow that literally takes you away from the fight and does what I call you very, very unique animation. And I think we classify as that as one of them for sure. I, I love doing Gears' fatal blow, man. It's so sick. Not gonna lie, guys. It was very hard to narrow it down to the top five fatal blows because there are so many amazing choices. I think some honorable mentions here have to be Kenshi, Havocs, and Johnny Cage's, man. They're, they're all just so well done. With that said, though, let me know down below whose fatal blow do you like the most in Mortal Kombat 1 and why? Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and take it one step at a time.